Hello and welcome back to Infraspace. And thanks again to Dianic Software for giving me access to play this for you today. So as I loaded in, I noticed a message that flashed briefly on the concrete factory and then briefly on the fertilizer factory telling me that they needed more sulfur. So I think this one sulfur mine is not keeping up, which makes kind of makes sense. I should have probably put a second one down when I uh, built the fertilizer factory and didn't. Uh, so that should help with that process. I was also taking a look quickly at the electronics factories. We're still not quite getting enough electronics in, nor enough science pack one in here. And we also are not getting enough in here. So we definitely need more, yeah, so you're complaining about electronics. We definitely need more electronics. We might need more aluminum. We might also need more uh, science pack ones being made. Um, which these are all pretty, pretty full. Uh, actually not. So we might need a little bit more iron mining too, to start with. And then possibly also a little bit more uh, Science Pack 1. I, I'm suspecting it's going to be... Well, these produce pretty fast. Looks like about maybe 12 seconds. Whereas these are producing much, much slower. Might be double the amount of time without sitting here with the stopwatch and counting it. So if that's the case, this needs to have... Actually, it might be even slower. It might be more than double the amount of time. But if this is... If it's double, then each one of these needs to have two and a half of these supplying it. And that's in addition to what goes into... Oopsie. What goes into here for research. And as you can see... Science pack one, there's plenty in there, and there's not any science pack two in there, which makes sense because we're not supplying enough. Okay, so yeah, we need a little bit more electronics. Let's put up some more refinement electronics. I'm kind of hoping to unlock the uh, stadiums today also. But I'm also not sure how much longer we should go with this. Um, it seems to be that uh, while we can keep expanding production up, uh, by adding more habitats and then more food and whatnot for them. At a certain point, it kind of seems like we're going to hit a wall where um, where providing en enough people is going to cost... I guess it won't cost more, but it's going to cost so much in, in food and su supporting, re supporting infrastructure that it's not, you have to add a lot of people in order to add just a little bit in the, in the way of manufacturing. So, because we've already pushed ourselves over again and need to put down another habitat. And I'm just looking at uh, workers to housing, or jobs to housing, not even looking at population that needs to catch up yet. So, um, so I'm, I'm, I'm hoping, I'm thinking this might be the final episode. Uh, we'll get as far as we get today. And then in... Um, in the future, when uh, next the next major alpha, or maybe second next major alpha comes out, whenever the next time I get access to it is, uh, we'll take a look again and see what changes there are. I may start that series at a midpoint of the game, like play of the beginning part off camera, especially if it's kind of the same, and start somewhere in, in you know this area and start looking at some of the new stuff. Uh, as I'm assuming the new stuff's going to come along, things like nuclear power. Um, coming along at some point uh, but right now the game kind of just feels I don't know very slow to me with being able to only have uh, that's not what I wanted only have one spaceport that works it means you can only get so many people in at a time uh, and it looks like we need to actually upgrade computers now so so now we're going to upgrade um, add another computer factory which means more electronics factories that we're already starving out of so you can see there's kind of like a a, a spiral here where at a certain point adding more people means adding more of a lot of things and so then you have to add even more people to support that and so you have to add a lot of houses uh, and a lot of buildings in order to support them so I'm hoping there's some advancements excuse me sorry I needed a drink I'm hoping there's some advancements in things like um, uh, housing density and some advancements in things like, uh, or some, some improvements in things like uh, play speed, being able to double or triple the, the, the speed of the playback here, or the, the gameplay simulation rather, uh, would be helpful. Um, 
yeah, those are just kind of things that I'm, I'm kind of hoping to see. I don't know if we'll see those or not, but I'm still very much interested in this game. All right, so we have, yeah, this one downgraded because it didn't have enough computers and somebody else is going to join them soon. Yeah. So we need to, we need to step up the computer production. So let's go ahead and add another computer fact. Nope, that's concrete. Let's add another computer factory. Maybe we can put it on this side of the road with the, uh, with the other folks there. And that's, I'm assuming, going to need a dedicated microchip factory. The other one was pretty well uh, supported or one-to-one uh, -one kind of thing. So we'll have that. And that means we need a bunch more electronics factories. It means, of course, we need more housing. Uh, let's see. And we probably need another aluminum mine. Which means we're going to have to go hit another... Oh, we already started this one over here. Right. Okay. Uh, let's... I think we need to add another housing unit. Survival food's not holding up very well either. Uh, let's add some more of that. Wrong button. Add that in. It looks like they kind of go by proximity, so... That's working out okay for the near ones, but not so much for the far ones. And this one's going to devolve soon. I'm hoping to be able to build that stadium. That way we can um, get at least one more of these things filled up. But Home Robots is far enough away uh, that I don't I don't know that I want to do that, uh, go that far in this series. All right. And so there's also a lot of a lot of downtime. Yes, I could expand more houses, but we're constrained by the spaceport. Uh, and it looks like maybe like one new uh, uh, inhabitant. I don't know, maybe once a, once a minute or so. And so you're kind of you're kind of really constrained by time and by. The spaceport more than anything else. I mean, it wouldn't if I could have two or three spaceports. Yeah, there another one just came out, so it's been about a minute. Um, if I could have two or three spaceports supporting this and supporting my growth, um, I think I'd be in a much better position. All right, looks like we might be getting computers back now, boosting up that production. There, yeah, that's growing, and that's going to grow in a moment too. Okay, uh, we probably need we need some more electronics, but we need to get some, these people moved in. So the, the, the kind of time you spend waiting is um, is a little painful, especially for a YouTube series. And like I said, if I could speed up the simulation, it wouldn't be so bad. But uh, giving me the ability to also have... And I'll test the, the, the spaceport thing again, just to be sure. But I'm pretty sure it's still going to not ever output any people. Any yeah, any any people. Let's, let's keep an eye on that, since all we have to do at this point is just wait for people to come in. Because uh, right now, and then these just jumped up. So right now we, it, oh, it is, did it steal it? Was there a bug before? Did I not notice it before? We just got two in, in a row out of that one. Apparently I was incorrect. But now I'm not seeing any come out of this one. Oh, there goes one. Okay, maybe I was incorrect. Or apparently I was incorrect or it was fixed and... Uh, so let's, um, I guess let's add more then, right? Yeah, we need another habitat. Because we still don't have enough uh, space for everyone that we need to have. That'll put us over. Okay, you're a pink truck. It isn't one a minute. But it also isn't consistent, because we just got two pink trucks out of this one in a row. And none out of this. I'd be interested to know more about what triggers um, population. Yeah, this is why I thought I was only getting one. Maybe you just have to have more than one, and they just come to whichever but twice as often? No, there's a pink truck there now. 
I don't understand. Maybe I'll reach out to the developers, to Ponzel, uh, and see if... Or maybe I'll take a look on the Discord and see if there's a way to to um, understand that. But then, they're like, t they came pretty quickly together. And then they're not... Oh, you're not getting any oxygen. Well, that's a horse of a different color. Let's do something about that. How did you get to be so crooked? Yeah, there's a large gap there, and then one came out of this one. And then there's another large gap of time. Yeah, I think I'm gonna... I might... Uh, and then the one just came out of this one. But then sometimes there's two that are like back to back. So I think I will reach out to Punzel and find and find out if there's something we can do about that. But I think we can also just keep playing the way that it is. Um, I guess it couldn't hurt to add even another one. See if that makes a difference also. Uh, let's do that. Can I put it in there? No, of course not. Can we go here with it? Yes, but no. Oh, there it goes. Boom. Does that make a difference? Now I'm kind of in experimentation mode. And we can't click on them. They're not clickable. So even like these, we can click on it to see what it's doing. If you could even get like an expected passenger when you click on it, like expected arrival in blah, blah, blah. Uh, that would be useful. What did I see just going there? Must be the food truck went in there. There's another, there's a pink truck come out of this one. We have 10, or we have, well, we have, yeah, we have 10 spaces open now. Hmm. Definitely confusing. Or, not confusing, but uh, mysterious, I guess, would be the better way to word it. Um, hopefully we can figure out, okay, good, now it's finally upgrading. And we haven't gotten any again. Oh, there comes one out of number three now. Yeah. Don't know. All right, so we seem to be in a good place now with everything, but maybe good food. Yeah, I think we're going to need some more good food. So we are getting... So we're getting slightly too much meat. And slightly not enough vegetables, but that vegetable issue could have been the lack of fertilizer from before. Because of the lack of sulfur. I suppose. I guess it would be more important if this maintains a level. But on the other hand, we aren't making enough, I don't think. To, to support this many habitats. Although, yeah, there's some that are, are lacking a little. Um, and no, that truck's probably for that one. Yeah. So, it, it may just now be maintaining, but we're going to have a tough time adding another one here. So, I think it'll be worthwhile to add some more food, also. Uh, let's do services. Move this. Can I move this over just a little more? Maybe. And then... This fertilizer farm has fertilizer backed up and this doesn't need any. So one fertilizer farm may be able to support more than one vegetable farm. If I can get in here like that. And by the way, the connections to the road seem to prefer the roads going in this direction over the roads going in this direction for whatever reason. All right, good. You just got some fertilizer. And that should boost the vegetable production, but we're gonna very soon uh, need to... probably also add another food factory and we may need to add some more meat factories as well. So, yeah. Uh, are you complaining about anything over here? Electronics again. 
we have enough room that we could add another electronics factory. So I think we should. Can't get another one in there anyway. These are all pretty well packed. Ooh, I could, but I could potentially push that one back. Kind of stagger them front to back a little bit. That's an idea. So I could potentially also move this one over. Not by much. I don't think that buys me enough room for one more, but I can try it anyway. So whenever you move these, it looks like the trucks get confused. And we're definitely starving on the electronics. So that means we need another habitat, but we still are nine people short for the jobs we have, for the habitats we have. So I don't necessarily want to add another habitat in because that's just going to... It's not going to make our people come any faster. And I don't know what does make the people come faster. So uh, let's see. How is food going now? So now now meat is suffering. So we need, could use another uh, meat lab now. Meat, uh, yeah. Meat lab. Mmm, meaty. There. And you have... That might also not be enough... Oops, there's only one I wanted to click on. It might be. Enough. I'm probably gonna need another meat lab. This over here. Then I could put another fertilizer factory in here if I need one. I don't think I'm going to. But if I do. Oh yeah, vegetables are backing up now. Uh, so we're not... We're not consuming all of it, or enough of it, with the food factory. But we might be at a close approximation of good as far as meat goes for one food factory. Like, so... Four wasn't enough, but five appears to be possibly enough for uh, good food manufacturing. And it looks like we might have a surplus finally. Of good food. So that's good. Food. All right. And I'm sure you're still complaining about electronics. You are. Imagine that. Okay. And we have a housing issue again. Or a we still have the appointment issue. Yeah, still missing six people there, or five five people there. So we built our nanotubes factory. We're trying to get a stadium unlocked. You know, maybe I will pause the game here, and I'm just gonna let this grow. Maybe I'll add another habitat or two up here, and. Um, Get some population in and make some more electronics factories and then i'll come back in just as this uh, stadium is getting ready to finish so we can take a look at that at least in this episode so i'll be right back and welcome back stadium's just unlocked it actually jumped right from 118 to 120 so i didn't even get to get to see it uh but uh so a couple things that i did we'll take we'll say great to that and we'll just let stuff start building up it's fine it doesn't really matter at this point um i added another um uh, air processor out here with uh the requisite road and the requisite little tail road to keep this road straight uh the two habitats have upgraded although they're still waiting on about uh was that uh, 11 people here to fill up the um available housing and we do have more people than we have jobs right now uh, but I did add a fertilizer factory. I added an, a, uh, a basic farm here for some, some more survival food as well. Um, and I think it might be enough now. Maybe not. No, because no, none of them have more than one. I'm assuming as soon as they get to two, they immediately ship it out. So we might need just one more of those. But it's kind of hard to tell. Yeah, it shipped out right away. Uh, it's kind of hard to tell 
until everything kind of stabilizes because of that oh hey you just upgraded or you just added a new habitat where it dumps a bunch of the stockpile up and what's needed for maintenance versus what's needed for that uh, for that stock up uh, we still have electronics issues i did add i think two more of these or at least one more of these but we can add one more um that's a refinement electronics i fit another one in there no i can't oh how about up here haha <laughs> okay I may move that one down here then. Nope. How about like that? Can I then get another one in here? Yes, I think I saw it flash briefly. Nope, I did not. Oh, maybe I can. There it is. Okay, I just added two. That'll work. That also gets our, our jobs up above our population again. Just in time to add another uh, another draw, which is the stadium. Before we do the stadium, I'm just going to go ahead and put down another basic habitat, though. And another um, uh, basic food here. Uh, because I think we're going to need it. And uh, But I think we have plenty of oxygen. Yeah, there's some still stockpiled in some of these. 11 there. So I think we're good on oxygen right now. And that's filling up pretty fast. Survival food's filling up pretty fast too. So, um, we might not have needed that one, but it's close enough. Okay. And then as soon as we get uh, a few more people, actually, we can go probably go ahead and take a look at that. It's moving that's under services. Yeah, there it was. I clicked twice. And a stadium is big. Holy cow, is that big? Okay. How about if we put stadiums up here, maybe? Uh huh. Let's start there. How many workers do you need? 20 workers. Holy crap. Okay, but you can at least start producing stuff. Um, hopefully you didn't steal workers from essential stuff like food and air. Please. Uh, and then we need to add yet another habitat. Because we don't have enough. Because we're going to gain another 5 people with this. But it only gets us up to 420. And we need to have uh, 424, so that'll be another basic habitat, which means, of course, another uh, uh, another long time before we have enough population. Um, we could potentially, I mean, we're not using these, so if we need to deep, I mean, I wish we could deprioritize, I guess we can't. But if we need to deprioritize, we could deprioritize science, because we're not using it anyway. But hopefully at least that... I don't know where the workers got taken from. But hopefully at least that uh, takes... Workers from places we don't... We can afford to lose them. Like... Science-related stuff. Although, again, I don't know where they all went. You'd think I would notice one by now. Electronics, huh? You need electronics, huh? It also looks like you need some aluminum, so... Yeah. At least we have some, some stockpiles so that if we do decide to do another research, we can. Uh, is this now upgrading the... or adding to these? It is indeed. So, that's good. And it's spreading pretty fast. We're pr I'm guessing we're probably going to need another stadium. Which means, of course, 20 more workers. Uh, but we'll see how this one kind of is able to maintain, uh, because I don't know. Uh, we don't know the decay rate or the consumption rate on these things either. Uh, good food is struggling a little there, but I'm going to suspect we have in there too. We have some stockpiled, so there must be trucks on the way. Uh, already. Don't know what the good food truck looks like. The green. All right, come on. Okay, there. Is that it there? No. That should be blue. No, it's green. It's like green. And there's two pink trucks nearby each other there again. Hmm. I suppose I could just do one of these because um, 
It's not going to hurt. Because they're still running. And they're not s sacrificing any jobs anyway. And you just got a whole line of uh, computers coming in there. The purple and pink trucks there. But yeah, we're, we're not filling up the people that fast. So hopefully we... Hopefully I can get an answer to that. That would be really nice. Um... Nice to have. Nice to do. Yeah, this one stadium is definitely not going to be able to keep up. We're going to need more. But it's going to take some time to get to. And I don't think we want to spend the time to get there. So I think what we should do is um, call this a series for right now. And definitely come back uh, in the near future with another another series of some kind. Whether that is picking up at somewhere near this point, uh, they're picking up at this point on this map if things are changed enough, or things are changed at the right way, so that uh, this can um, be picked up, or starting a new map, but picking up at a similar spot here, somewhere where we're working on toward robotics, but not quite there yet, and getting ready to unlock city level four kind of thing. Um, or... If, if there's a simple answer to the uh, to the to this solution this problem um, I, I may just come right back in with another episode uh, yet this week but uh, if you're watching this live uh, or yeah watching this live as it's released um, there will be an episode of, of satisfactory tomorrow and if you're watching it in in arrears well maybe the next series is already available and you don't have to worry about it so uh, so thank you all for joining me today and I will see you next time Bye for now.